Epithelial practice quiz number one. We're going to look at some slides. You're going to see if you can figure out what they are, and at the very end, we will answer whether you got them right or not. Now, in a previous video, I showed you this list of six epithelial types that most labs will test you on, and I gave you specific characteristics for each one. For simple squamous, is it a single sheet that you're looking at from the top down? Are the cells irregularly shaped? Or does it look like little spaces surrounded by single layers of cells? Stratified squamous, we look for little buckets of cells. Simple cuboidal, we look for somewhat square cells that make up tubes. Simple columnar, we look for rectangular cells. And these rectangular cells often have a lot of goblet cells. Pseudostratified ciliated columnar epithelium, we look for cilia. And those are the little hairs. And this one will also have some goblet cells, but far fewer. In simple columnar, one of the things I didn't mention was that the nuclei will, be, will exist in a band of nuclei cells, whereas in pseudostratified ciliated columnar epithelial, the nuclei are at various levels in the tissue. And the last one is transitional. Does it look like the cells are overlapping? Do they look like peacock feathers or balloons? And I gave you this key. So if you have this key, you might write it down or print it up, however you want to do that. And you can look at each of these cells, and you can even pause at each of these cells so that you can take time to look at your key and try to key this thing out. Here's our first tissue. And if we go by the key, does the tissue have cilia? If it doesn't, we go to two. Is it a single sheet of cells? No. And we just follow our steps down until we find out which one we think that is. This is at the 40x objective. Some professors will test you at 40x. Uh, some will test you at a 10x objective. Here's our second slide of epithelial tissue. And take time to check out your key. And then write your answer down. Here is our third slide. And our fourth slide, our fifth slide, and our sixth slide. Okay, let's check our answers. The first slide was pseudostratified ciliated columnar epithelium. The second one was simple squamous. The third was transitional. The fourth was stratified squamous. The fifth, simple cuboidal and the sixth simple columnar. In this video I'm actually going to walk you through this quiz and show you how I would key these things out so that I could identify them accurately and correctly. I won't do this on the other quizzes so you'd have to watch this one first. Now this one, looking at my key, does the tissue have cilia? Absolutely. Does it have goblet cells? Absolutely. Do we see a distinct band of nuclei? Nope. It means it's got to be PCCE. This one, does the tissue have cilia? No. Is it a single sheet of cells that are irregular? Absolutely. That means it's simple squamous. This one, does it have cilia? No. Does it have a single sheet of cells that are irregular, or, or is it small spaces surrounded by a, by a single sheet of cells? No. Does it have little buckets of cells? No. Does it have square-shaped cells? No. Are they rectangular? No. Then, do they look like they're overlapping and resemble a peacock or balloons? Yep, they're overlapping. That's going to be transitional. This one, we'll go through one. Does it have cilia? No. Is it a single sheet of cells or spaces surrounded by a single sheet of cells? No. Does it have little buckets of cells? Absolutely. Stratified squamous. This one, cilia? No. Cells are regular? No. Single sheet? No. Does it have little buckets of cells? No. Does it have square shape making up tubes? Absolutely. That's a pretty square little cuboidal cell. And I can see little tubes here. So that's my simple cuboidal. And this last one, do we see a band of nuclei? Yeah. So let's go through my little list here. Does it have cilia? No, it looks like it might have some microvilli, so it could be PCCE. But let's keep going. Is it a single sheet of cells? No. Does it have little buckets of cells? No. Are they square shaped? No. Are they rectangular? Are the nuclei in bands and there are there a lot of goblet cells? There's a band of nuclei, there's goblet cells. This one is, you got it, simple columnar. 
Thanks for taking this quiz and check the other quizzes. I'll have a couple more of those up soon and hopefully this will get you prepared for your lab test.